Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you Microsoft Translator, which is a great tool for translating conversations in real time. So let's start here. I put in my name. I'm going to host my conversation in English. I'm using English. And we'll select Enter. Now, what's going to happen here is we'll see there's a conversation code that other people can use to join the conversation. Let's say someone is using their mobile phone in the room with me. They can just scan the QR code that we see here on the screen and they'll be able to see the conversation translated into the language of their choosing directly on the phone. Likewise, if they're using a laptop computer, they can go to the link assigned to the conversation. So let's see what that would look like to someone who's joining on a laptop. I'll just right click and open this in a new incognito window. Now let's just make sure we have that correct. So that person will come along and they will put in their name. Let's say my name is Robert and I'm following the conversation in this case in French and selects enter and we'll see here that Robert will be able to listen and have it translated automatically into French when I enter something so let's say I enter welcome to the classroom Now here on his screen, what he'll see is the conversation being translated. So I had just entered welcome Robert and we see it translated here into French for Robert. Now I can continue to type as much as I would like here. I can also just record with my voice by holding down the recording icon or holding down the spe space bar and speaking. Welcome to class. And over here, we see that translated into French for Robert. Now, anyone can join and choose any of the languages that they would like. So I could have one person join and use French, another person join and be using Chinese, and another using Spanish. Uh, so the options are quite plentiful for anyone to join the conversation in real time. Now the nice thing about this is that if Robert replies to me in French, it'll get translated back to me in English on my screen here. So that's Microsoft Translator. It's a really neat tool. I encourage you to try it out today. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com and practicaledtech.com.